with an investigation into why a man's houseboat went up in flames. I'm Tom Shad. One Portsmouth firefighter suffered minor injuries, but the person who lived there lost his home at the Nautical Boats Marina, and he tells our Brett Hall that he just wants to find out how this all happened. Brett? Yeah, Anthony Cottingham says he was finally living the life he wanted. He owned something that was his, a boat. And now, more than anything, he wants to know what or who took that from him. Anthony Cottingham just doesn't understand how his boat came to look like this Sunday night. It's a nightmare. Definitely. Viewer video captures Anthony's 1979 Uniflight 37 foot sport fishing yacht burning to a crisp. All you see is look like there was no boat ever there. Everything he owned, besides his dog Yo Yo, gone. When I went out for Thanksgiving, I shut everything down except for a TV and a light. This was Anthony's home. I had a blast, you know, I mean, it was, it was just great. It was great living. You wake up to beautiful scenery every morning, a boat rocks you to sleep at night. He decided to buy the boat earlier this year, fed up with the price of renting an apartment. He says the boat wasn't even operable at the time of the fire. It's one of the reasons he is so suspicious. I wouldn't put it past somebody doing something there. He says a few weeks prior, somebody messed with his jet ski. The fire department hasn't determined a cause yet because the boat is still in the water. Anthony has to pay the $2,000 to get it out. Yeah, I'm going to get fines and fees, you know, and mm -hmm. legal, and there are some damage to other boats. A big worry that Anthony says is already teaching him a large lesson. Get insurance. <laughs> get insurance. Definitely get insurance. Definitely, because with insurance, I wouldn't be so worried. Yeah, Anthony had no insurance and is currently staying with friends at different homes until he can get back on his feet. As for that injured firefighter we told you about before the peace, they are expected to make a full recovery. Brett Hall, 10 on your side.